Hello everyone. Welcome to Food Craft. Today's recipe has a different take to the regular bisi bele bhat. I was told by my Kannada friend that bisi is hot, bele is dal, and bhat is usually rice. And today I'm going to replace rice with millets. To make this recipe, I have taken 3/4 cup of foxtail millets. Wash it thoroughly under running water and soak it for about 3 hours. Let's make the sambar powder first. For that, heat a pan and add 2 teaspoons of ghee, 2 teaspoons of chana dal, 1 teaspoon of urad dal, 1 and 1/2 tablespoon of coriander seeds. Mix them well. Now add the cumin seeds that is half teaspoon. Add 5 to 6 red chilies. Roast them till they turn brown. Now add half a cup of grated coconut. Roast until it turns slightly brown. When it is done, cool the mixture and grind it to a fine powder. In the meanwhile, let's pressure cook the millets. which has been soaking for 3 hours and 1/3 cup of tur dal i have soaked this for about 30 minutes add turmeric powder and cook it on medium flame for 4 whistles let's make the sambar with lots of vegetables for that heat a pan and add 2 teaspoons of ghee Half teaspoon of mustard seeds, half teaspoon of cumin seeds, half teaspoon asafoetida powder, roast them nicely in ghee and add few curry leaves. And one large onion cut into pieces. Fry them nicely until the onions become slightly transparent. Add 1 carrot cut into pieces, handful of beans, 1 potato cut into pieces and 1 drumstick cut up. Sauté the vegetables nicely in ghee. Sprinkle some salt to taste and 1/4 teaspoon of turmeric powder. Add 2 cups of water. Let it boil nicely and cover with a lid. Cook it for about 5 minutes until the vegetables soften. Once the vegetables are nicely cooked, Add half a cup of tamarind extract. Now add 3 teaspoons of the sambar powder we have made at the beginning. You can add more as per your taste. Mix the sambar powder nicely with the vegetables and cook for a minute or two. The millet and tur dal looks to be well cooked. So let's transfer it into the pan. Mix the cooked millet and tur dal in sambar until you get the right consistency. At this stage you can adjust the quantity of the sambar powder, salt and water. Now transfer the millet bisibele bath into a serving bowl. I hope you all liked today's recipe and if you did please try it and share the video with your friends and family. Happy cooking.